They call me Squirrel. What's going on, Squirrel Squad? It's your boy, the Squirrel. And uh, this one here, I can't remember who sent this one over to me. Mm, wish I could. Uh, could have been one of the usual suspects. Thomas, Johan, John. Uh, I'm not sure. Could have been one of the crumpets. A lot of people send me a lot of stuff. And I can't remember who sent me this one. I was looking for my notes to see where I had it written down. And I was going to start searching through emails and Instagram and find it. But... Just raise your hand and say hi, please. Be like, yo, thank you for doing my recommendation. You're welcome. Somebody sent this over to me and said, you need to check out these cover letters or these. So basically, it's like famous people reading, I think, letters from people, I guess. That's kind of what I got. I decided that I'm going to try to do this series. And uh, there's some great people in this series that I've seen. And uh, I think the, what's the YouTube channel? Oh, whoops. And it's okay. Just a little applause. There. Hold on a second. The YouTube channel is called Letters Live. So from what I understand, this is people reading, famous people reading letters and stuff. I'm not, we're not sure, but I want to get into it and check it out because if it's awkward and weird, it's, well, it's for me. And uh, yeah, that's, that's what I want to do. Matter of fact, uh, we're going to do two in a row because I see this other video off to the side over here. And uh, we're going to do two because they're both from Benedict Cumberbatch. So let's do that. Let's just do two in the same video. Ooh, how daring. Here we go. You ready? I'm ready. First one. Benedict Cumberbatch reads the best cover letter I've written. Here we go. Dear sir, I like words. I like fat, buttery words such as ooze, turpitude, gluttonous, toady. I like solemn, angular, creaky words such as straight-laced, cantankerous, pecunious, valedictory. I like spurious, black-as-white words such as mortician, liquidate, tonsorial, demimond. I like suave V words such as svengali, svelte, bravura, verve. I like crunchy, brittle, crackly words such as splinter, grapple, jostle, crusty. I like sullen, crabbed, scowling words such as skulk, glower, scabby, slippy. Um, real quick, sorry I interrupted that, Benedict. I find it absolutely fascinating and I find it lovely that there's a room full of people who just want to listen to this guy read words. Like he's just reading... The, the ramblings of a madman and a cover letter, basically. Uh, but I think it's great. This audience is captivated listening to this. I think it's great. Slippy. He forgot Slippy, but let's continue. Churl. I like, oh, heavens, my gracious, land sake words such as Trixie, Tucker, Genteel, horrid. <laughs> I like wormy, squirmy, mealy words such as crawl, blubber, squeal, drip. I like sneakily chuckling words such as cowlick, gurgle, burble, and burp. I like the word screenwriter better than copywriter. <laughs> so I decided to quit my job in New York in an advertising agency and try my luck in Hollywood. Before taking the plunge, I went to Europe for a year of study, contemplation, and horsing around. I've just returned, and I still like words. May I have a few with you? Robert Parash. That's a pretty good cover letter. I mean, imagine getting that as a cover letter. That's crazy. Um, all right, let me get the next one loaded up. All right, this is part two from Benedict Cumberbatch. This is the second one where he reads a 17-year-old Tom Hanks letter. Oh, boy. All right, let's get into it. Letter is live. Dear Mr. Hill, seeing that I have seen your fantastically entertaining and award-winning film, The Sting, starring Paul Newman and Robert Redford, and enjoyed it very much, it is altogether fitting and proper that you should discover me. <laughs> now, right away, I know what you're thinking. Who is this kid? And I can understand your apprehensions. I am a nobody. No one outside of Skyline High School has heard of me. My looks are not stunning. I'm not built like a Greek god, and I can't even grow a mustache. <laughs> but I figure if people will pay to see certain films, they will pay to see me. Well, how right was he, right? I mean, he was dead on. Let's work out the details of my discovery. <laughs> now, we can do it the way Lana Turner was discovered, me sitting on a soda shop stool, you walk in and notice me, and bango, I am a star. 
Or maybe we could do it this way. I stumble into your office one day, beg for a job to get rid of me. You give me a stand-in part in your next film. While shooting the film, the star breaks his leg in the dressing room. And because you are behind schedule already, you arbitrarily place me in his part. And bango, I am a star. <laughs> now, all these plans are fine by me. Or we could do it any way you would like. It makes no difference to me. But let's get one thing straight, Mr. Hill. I do not want to be some big-time Hollywood superstar with girls crawling all over me. Just a hometown American boy who has hit the big time, owns a Porsche, and calls Robert Redford Bob. <laughs> Bob Redford. Respectfully submitted your pal forever, Thomas J. Hanks. So cool. So, so cool. How cool is that, right? So these are all, I, I, from what I'm looking at, from what I kind of researched a little bit, it looks like these are all real letters. And, and they just come from reading them. And I think it's kind of a cool form of art. Um, the, just the reading of the letter, the delivery, the enunciations, all that kind of stuff, you know. Um, looking forward to seeing some more people do it. Cover, cover batch is he's great he's really good at it you know he really really owned the part of both of those people with the cover letter and with the tom hanks letter uh i like this a lot of this is good i'm looking forward to doing more of these hopefully you guys like them so it makes it worth my while to do more of these if not maybe i'll just record them while i watch them because i'll enjoy them and then let's put them on the patreon account if nobody likes them on the main channel but i think you will i don't think this was sent to me and it's something that Everyone's going to be like, ah, poo-poo. I think people are going to be like, ooh, this is interesting. This is fun. Let's, let's have a gander. Hopefully. We'll see. What did you think of this, huh? Well, letter. What letter? If you could have one thing that you could have someone read, what letter would it be? And why is it Chatio that you want to see read it? Oh, I, I'm with you. Just wondering. Anyways, uh, tell me which thought of better to cover badge. Tell me which thought of the Tom Hanks letter, the cover letter. Tell me what you think of me. It's all right. I got thick skin. No, I don't. No, be nice. Don't don't say what you think of me. I don't want to know. I'm just kidding. It doesn't matter. I can. Son of a. It's getting late. <laughs> I love you guys. Take care of yourself. I gotta go. I'm out of here. I'm waving. On a jet plane. Scroll up. <laughs>